Good evening, brothers and sisters. I want to testify to give the honor and glory to the Lord. When I first came to church, the Lord told me that he was going to help me with my son, that he was going to help him with his school, and that he was going to give him the wisdom and the knowledge, and that he was also going to help me pay for the school. Uh, when my son was little, he had to have surgery because he had hearing problems. The doctor also recommended for him to go to um, speech therapy. So throughout his um, elementary and middle school and high school years, he had to go to school and he also had to go to um, speech therapy. And then when he graduated from high school uh, three years ago, he said, Mom, I do not want to go to college. It, school is too difficult for me. Um, it is not for me and um, I don't want to do it. Well, the Lord gave him a scholarship as soon as he graduated from high school, and that motivated him to go to school. Um, the first semester, he was really happy, um, but towards the end, he wanted to give up because it was getting too difficult for him. Well, the second semester, then the Lord manifested and put helpers around him. He, the Lord also provided um, the money to pay for his tuition. And uh, a few weeks ago, my son graduated with his AA, and I want to give the honor and glory to the Lord because this would have never been able to be possible without him. Hello, brothers and sisters. I would like to testify to bring honor and glory to God. My mother passed away unexpectedly on July 17th, after her health suddenly declined within a month. This was puzzling since God had spoken of positive changes to come for my mom through past prophecies. I prayed for her when she was hospitalized and laid hands on her when I could. I believed God was going to heal her in the flesh and she would serve him in the congregation. I felt her health complications and death were unfair. Although I was deeply saddened, I continued to listen to the live streams when I was able to because I knew it was important to continue to seek God. On Sunday, August 16th, I was listening to the closing prayer during a live stream with our sister, Mary Louisa. God began to prophesy through her. One of the things he addressed were people whose loved ones passed away and believed their death was unfair. He promised to bring comfort and understanding. I was surprised and in awe because I wanted to receive a personal prophecy, but have not been able to congregate due to location closures from COVID-19. But God gave this tremendous blessing and miracle to myself and others who needed to be at peace. This demonstrates God's compassion, love, and care for us through unforeseen obstacles. Most importantly, it reveals God truly sees every detail of our lives does not overlook our concerns, and continues to keep his promise that he will not leave us or forsake us. This I testify to magnify the Lord.